the Bereans, as recorded in Acts 17, verses 1 through 15. The Apostle Paul and Silas had been at Philippi. That's where they had met and baptized Lydia, their first convert in Europe. And then they headed to the next city in Philippi, called Thessalonica. There they came, and they met first with the Jewish people in the synagogue, and they told them all about what Jesus Christ had done. They said, Jesus is the Christ. The Bible said he would come and do what he did. On day two, they proclaimed the same exact message. Jesus is the Christ. The Bible said he would come and do what he did. Then on day three, they proclaimed the same message. Jesus is the Christ. The Bible said he would come and do what he did. Some of the Jews believed the message. Some of them were jealous and did not want to follow. Those who were jealous stirred up the people and brought in others, and they started a riot in that whole city. The people got everything going crazy, and they went to Jason's house. Jason was where Paul and Silas were staying. Jason came out, and the people asked, where is Paul and Silas? They said, these men have caused trouble everywhere, and Jason has welcomed them. You see, they grabbed Jason and brought him to the city official. They couldn't find Paul, so they brought Jason. Well, we must postpone, and then we will let them go. He was hoping to avoid all that turmoil. That night, Jason returned to his spot, and he told Paul and Silas that they'd better go. And so they left, and they headed to the next city, to the city of Berea. There the people were a little bit different. They met again with the Jewish people in the synagogue. This time when they proclaimed Jesus is the Christ, the Bible said he would come and do what he did. The Bereans checked it out. The Bible says they were more noble than those in Thessalonica. And they checked out the scriptures. And sure enough, the Bible had prophesied about everything that Jesus would do. They looked and they said, let's see if what Paul said is true. It was true. They believed in the message of Jesus. They showed their nobleness. Then the people from Thessalonica sent a bunch of people. And they came to that city. They stirred up a riot in that city. And again, they left Berea, Paul and Silas did, and they headed to the city of Athens. At that time, Timothy joined Silas. And now they were also ready to proclaim the message in every spot they could. Paul and Silas at Thessalonica and Berea.